everyone, welcome back to another pick a card reading. Today we will have four piles for you to choose from. We have group one, group two, group three and group four. I didn't want to add any crystals because I want you to use your intuition and if that's more difficult then just go with whatever you feel like. Today we're going to be seeing who you are going to date next and when. So let's start off with group number one. Group number one, let's see who you're going to date and when. So, who is this person? We have the Owl Spirit, which is so cute. I love this card. This is one of my favourites. The Owl Spirit and we have the Flamingo Spirit. So, what I'm getting is this person is very wise. Owls are normally a person and someone who's very wise. Someone who's very intelligent, but it also has this, like, beautiful, kind of happy outgoing energy so they're very intellectual but they're also i wouldn't say they're creative i say they're creative but in a different way so not typically a, not what you'd call a typical creative type so not maybe like painting or anything but they have their own creativity that they express on their own it's kind of they keep to themselves but it makes them very happy um and it says embrace the in-between so i definitely feel like they have these two types of personalities. They're very strategical and very like mathematical, but they also are very creative, outgoing, and they have a colorful personality basically. So they might look normal, like normal, whatever normal is, like a plain kind of person. I don't, I don't wanna say plain, cause that's not the right word, but they're not very colorful in what they dress to say. They look just like the average person, I guess, but they are very playful and with you, they would be very, very playful, and I love that. I just think that's really nice. And I love this colour. This pink is just like, boom, it's just like coming out at me. So I feel like this person, if they approach you, it's going to be quite, it's going to be quite easy for them to approach you. That's only for some of you, though. That section I just said, that's only for some of you. So let's see what else we have. We have letting go, raising your standards, and we also have trust your intuition. So I definitely feel like this person is going to bring out a thought in you that's gonna make you trust, ha have to trust your intuition. So it's gonna be somebody who is different, new, someone you've never had before. And because you've been raising your standards, this person is, has also been raising their standards. So you two are gonna be very balanced with each other and letting go. You and this person have been going for a lot and because you two are gonna get into a relationship, this is mirroring both of you. So you two have gotten through, gone through quite similar experiences. And letting go is, you're letting go of the past now and you're bringing in this new person and it's bringing in this person really easily. I'm seeing a lot of flow and there's the moon here and this reveals a lot of hidden emotions. So yeah, I'm feeling that it's gonna be really easy for you to like this person. It may take some time. I'm feeling like a very slow kind of like step by step I'm getting, but this person seems to be really, really nice. Very, ma I'm feeling quite mature. I'm thinking maybe between like 20 and 28 in that bracket. That's quite a big bracket, but that's what I got. Uh, could also be 16 for you younger people watching. Yeah, okay, so. Who is this person? And we got the Three of Swords. So I don't feel like they recently went through heartbreak, but I feel like they went through a few experiences in their life that made their heart break. And it's teaching them that it's okay to love and it's safe to love. And this, these, I feel like they're now, they're just viewing them as experiences when before, when they were going through all of this, it was just horrible for them. And they were just confused on what they wanted in the sense that they thought, what they wanted was true but it, it isn't now they can really see clearly what they want and these are just like past relationships i feel this could also be friendships that they had that really meant a lot to them and it's just making them more stable it's making them more grounded because they're deciding this is what i want i want a new relationship and it's going to come in divine timing and it's all going to flow really nicely because the person who i'm going to be with is i'm going to make sure that they are the right one and Obviously, it doesn't, this relationship doesn't have to last forever and ever, but it just is a lot of stable. I'm getting like Taurus kind of energy, and they didn't, don't have to be a Taurus, but I'm getting Taurus kind of energy. It's very stable. Um, think more a lot with their head, not with their heart. So I feel like it could take a while for them to settle down with you, but I feel like you will have this slow 
opening up to each other, which is really, really nice. And we have the Seven of Wands. And as I say, I feel like this, this, I feel like this is also you. This could be them and this is you. This is also like, as I say, this mirroring. This is like you fighting off people who have like, this is you fighting off people who you don't need anymore. This is you letting go of toxic relationships. And I definitely feel like this is this is them as well. This is your future partner who is going to come in. And this is like setting boundaries as well. Setting really clear boundaries as to what they want. And we also have, you might not know now, but you will. You might not readily believe this. It might even spook you a bit. But there are those who choose this very lifetime in a large part knowing you'd be there now that's what we call a reputation hugs so let's have a look at this okay so I definitely feel like this is someone you have you are destined to meet this is someone who's going to really see suit you really well and I just feel that you compliment each other so nicely I'm getting this, like this kind of energy so I feel like this jigsaw puzzle and it's got two pieces and it's just slowly coming together and it's just joining really nicely I love this this is so cute so I'm not getting Oh, actually, you know, I'm getting hair colour. Blonde, brown, maybe ginger. I'm not really too sure on that. And let's see about your... Let's get the star signs. This this doesn't have to be this, per this certain star sign, but I just want to see what sort of star sign. I'm getting Cancerian, a water sign, possibly a Pisces or a Scorpio. That was like when I first did this... When I was tuning into you guys' energy, it was definitely a Cancerian that was coming through really, really strong. So we've got the Four of Swords. And say so slow energy and meditating on this person, kind of deciding if they're the, the right one. And we also have the Ten of Coins and the Page of Wands, the Sun. We've got lots of different cards. So as I say, I'm feeling like from the cards that I have now, definitely a water sign for sure. Possibly an earth sign, so they could have earth qualities. So Taurus, Virgo and Capricorn and Scorpio, Cancer and Pisces is very prominent here. I'm not seeing any air sign, maybe an air sign, but not, not any earth, they're not any fire signs. So possibly air, earth and water, but not fire. So yeah, let's see when you'll meet this person. We have the Three of Cups. So I feel like you could already know this person. You could have already met this person. You could already have hung out with this person and had a really good time. If you don't know who this is, they could be coming in the next three weeks to three months. I don't want to say three years because that's a bit too long. You could be with them for three years. But that is what I'm getting. So I hope this is accurate to you. I feel like I need to pull another card just to see what else their emotional... What's, what's their, like, what's their emotional side? So I'll get an idea of what sign they are. Scarab beetle. Magic works through. So they could actually be a fire sign. But I'm definitely feeling more earth and earth and water is definitely more prominent. But yeah, so I really hope this resonated with you. If it did, please comment down below. Thank you so, so much. We're nearly at 500 subscribers. Like that is insane. And don't forget to subscribe. If you'd like a private reading with me, I'm doing a March sale at the moment. I'm doing one, one question or a five minute general reading for only five pounds. And if you purchase this five pound reading, you'll get 20% off a 25 minute reading. So thank you so, so much. Don't forget to look in the description below if you'd like a personal reading. And I will see you all in my next video. Thank you so much. Bye. Okay, group number two. Hello, hello, hello. So let's see who this person is you're going to be in a relationship with. And let's go. We got the fox spirit. Think on your feet. So this person could be a fire sign. Definitely very, 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 very strong business. Uh, knows what they want kind of person. That's what I'm getting. Fiery, sexy. They don't have to be a fire sign. They could just be very sexy as well. You want to get like fire, igniting flames, that sort of thing. We also have the white raven spirit, trust in magic. So I feel like it could be an air sign as well. And we have mag make music. Sorry, can't speak today. Make music. Oops. Be honest with yourself. And we also have the organize these cards. One, two. They could have this person could be black, have black hair, blonde hair, ginger hair, black, 
brown hair. Literally all, all the hair colours. And I'm feeling the age 26 onwards. And we also have, it's not as if you need anyone. It says, for as long as you wish to keep them in your life, whoever they are, whoever, sorry, whoever they may be, understanding them, as opposed to changing them, while, will wildly improve the chances that they'll wish to keep you in their life. On the other hand, you're pretty much stuck with me. Oh, wow, how I love you, the universe. So this, this card is relating to the fact that this person's going to open you up to new opportunities and a new way of thinking because they're going to be thinking in a way that's very new to you and you're not going to judge it. So don't just think that it's not you need anyone is not true because this is a, a partner. I'm not reading that. I'm reading what it said on the back. Definitely feel like this person's going to open you up to a new opportunity and I'm getting this like giving you something. So they could be somebody who gives quite a few gifts and they like music. I feel like you two will make music. This could be a sexual reference. Or this could just be the fact that you enjoy music together. I feel like one of you might be in a band. One of you might play guitar. One of you might play like an unusual instrument that not everyone plays, like a trombone or something. And I feel like this person is just really, really calm and it just makes you feel calm. It's going to be someone who is going to make you trust in life again. I feel like you've had a tough time the last five years, roughly four, five, six years. It's going to be, it's been quite tough for you and I'm getting this like agitated feeling. So I feel like you're like, go, go, go. I just want, I just want to move on. I just want to push forward. I just want a new relationship. This person is coming. So don't worry. And I know you've, I feel like both of you have been in very similar situations. I feel like, you know what this is, right? This is you and these are all the swords that are kind of stopping you from moving on or you just feel trapped. And what this person is gonna do is just pick up those swords and just get rid of them. And they just be like, nah, you don't need any of that. I'm here, you, you don't need to feel burdened anymore. You don't need to feel like nothing's happening because things are happening for you. And I'm just gonna pick all this crap up for you. And I'm just gonna throw it out because you don't need this anymore. I'm gonna do, we're gonna clear. We're just gonna clear our karma together. We're gonna clear everything and it's all gonna be perfectly fine. So when are you gonna meet this person? Is gonna be the queen of wands, hello. So it's gonna be a time when you are empowering yourself, when you're focusing on yourself and you are bringing out this gorgeous light beam that's inside you and it's and in normal terms of a way to explain this is you're embracing your inner queen your inner um goddess or it doesn't matter if you're a man or a woman goddess just is for a male as well just your inner independence is kind of, is coming out and this is when you're going to meet this person and it could be in the next three weeks you could also already know this person and they could bring out this side of you this independent kind of like let's just kind of do the damn thing let's just start this right now so yeah three weeks as i say you could already know this person and yeah, what else? Let's see if there is anything else. Is there anything else? Please clarify the Queen of Wands for me. Thank you very much. So we got the Page of Wands. So yes, this is you and this is them. I feel like they're gonna, you two are gonna be exploring together. They're, this person's gonna be showing you places that you've never been before. It's gonna be showing you a side of you that you've never seen before and they're just going to take your hand and help you to explore new ways of thinking, new places you have been for. And I feel like you are quite a person who's quite used to being safe and being in their bubble. And this is someone who's going to gently just pull you out and kind of be like, it's okay, it's safe, we can do this together. Let's go. Let's get off your throne and let's just take your throne with you and let's just go explore. I feel like we just want more one more animal spirit card just to see what this person is like. And let's see if I've got any more messages. As I say, it could be a fire sign, water sign. I'm not getting a specific sign, so I'm sorry about that. Probably maybe a Pisces or an Aries. Um, is this the right card? Yes. So I've got the bee spirit. Sweet results await. So that is just enough clarification that this person is coming in really, really nicely. And there's no blockage here though, I feel like. I feel like you've cleared a lot of your blockages. And you also got the see the big picture. And this is definitely relating to both these cards. So I feel like the giraffe spirit is for your partner and the bee spirit is for you. These colors are just so complimentary. I'm getting a lot, I'd say a lot of fire and I don't feel any air, maybe air, but 
I'm not entirely sure and I love how these colours just match up so we've got the yellow of the bee and the yellow of the queen and then we've got like the orange of the giraffe and the orange of the page of wands so that's really really nice as I say I feel like you've been feeling quite small and quite um you're building yourself up and you're almost sweetening your personality you're kind of bringing out this personality that's always been inside you so you've just been pushed down a little bit so you're just refining those little tiny bits as you're going along if that makes sense and see the bigger picture I feel like as I say this person really likes to explore loves to see new places loves to travel or has been traveling quite a lot and is quite well traveled should we say and knows has got quite a lot of experiences to, to tell you and I feel like they are a very big storyteller so yeah let's just get clarification on when you'll meet when will group number two meet their partner we have justice also, can I just say, guys, I've got 444 on my phone and I just think that's really funny. So that's just clarification that this is right. <laughs> so justice is the number 11. So you could meet this person in 11 days, 11 weeks. I feel like 11 days. And because of, um, the number 11 is two, I just feel like that's just massive clarification that this person is going to be really meant for you. And I just feel like this is going to be a gorgeous relationship. It's going to be really easy, very loving, very sweet, quite romantic and yeah i see this person might have blue eyes brown eyes yellowy golden eyes okay so thank you so so much for watching guys thank you so much we nearly have 500 subscribers honestly it means the absolute world to me i love every single one of you please subscribe down below if you would like to see more videos from me and if you'd like to book a private reading feel, please feel free i'm doing a march sale if you'd like to ask me a one question, I have a general reading for five pounds for five minutes, then please request, uh, please uh, email me or you can DM me in my Instagram. All the information is down below. Or if you'd like to do a longer reading, I do 25 minutes for 33 pounds. But if you purchase a five minute reading, you will get the 25 minute reading at 20% off just to let you know. So thank you so much for watching and thank you for being here. And I love you all and I'll see you soon. Bye. Hello group number three, thank you so much for being here and let's get started with your reading. Who is your partner who you're going to be with next? So let's see, we have the Electric Eel Spirit. Oh, I love this card, this is so cool. I recently just got this deck and I haven't seen this card yet and it's just, that's beautiful. Bring your ideas to life. The Dog Spirit, love that. Be loyal to what you love. We also got Rise Above Problems. Romantic partner, gorgeous, love that. And we also got moving forward fearlessly. So before I pick out any more cards, I'm just going to say that I feel like this person could be a water sign or an air sign. I'm getting they're very emotionally stable and or they're just working on their emotions to become more emotionally stable, to become more openly emotional. And I feel like this person's gonna be really, really loyal and is gonna be almost like your best friend. They could be your best friend now, or they could be a friend soon and it could develop into a relationship. I also feel like this is a definite romantic partner because we have the romantic partner card. And this is someone who could have black hair, who could have, yeah, black hair is very prominent. They could also, if they're a woman, could have blonde hair or brown hair. They could also, as a guy, have brown hair. Um, I'm not feeling that the guy could have blonde hair. Maybe, but I'm not really feeling that. And I feel like this could is this is going to make you blossom this relationship and I feel like you're rising above problems now that this person this person's going to open you up to a new way of thinking and it's going to help you to become more open and more stable I feel like you're rising above problems now there's going to there's been a few mishaps in your life and it's you're just getting over them now and this person is just going to be a little step it's going to help you just step up a bit more and kind of get out of your comfort zone and to explore the world and you're moving forward into this relationship quite quickly so you could actually be in this relationship quite quickly and quite soon this could also as i say be a friend first so you could also you could know this person already you could be like flirting back and forth you're just not sure who it is and yeah i feel like this person could be how old 18 to 30 so in that in that range but maybe 27 27 25 i'm getting the numbers and we also got number 19 and 24 so that could also be their age let's see what else we got 
page of cups right so this really relates to the electric eel spirit bring your ideas to life this is the sort of person that once they say they're going to do something they're going to do it and they're not just going to faff around and just go around the edges and just all oh, tiptoe they're like really going for it and this is someone who's going to give you a really wholesome relationship something that's going to really just suit you so well and it's going to be very emotion it's going to very how do i say this it's going to provide you with a lot of stable emotions and it's just going to help you to accept that there are good people in the world and there are good people who have your best interests at heart and someone who's just going to really show you that it's safe to love and it's safe to open your emotions that's what i got out of that i feel like if someone could be 20 or onwards because judgment is the number 20 and two and zero make two so that means that two is a partnership and this is someone who you look up to as well and it's going to be a definite loyal partner it's someone who you can trust and it's someone who will always be there for you when you really need it and it'll bring out this side of you that you haven't really shown a lot to others or you've kind of pushed down over the years because people have told you that I don't like the way you do that. You could be a very spiritual person and people have told you that's not good enough. You could be, I'm getting like gothic. I feel like you could be like a witchy sort of person or you could be into like gothic kind of like black and fishnets and stuff like that it could like that sort of that sort of aesthetic so it could be this part of you that you've hidden away from people and this person's going to bring it out of you and it's going to be very loyal i feel like um i'm getting leo as well um because i feel like leo is loyal um and i feel like the dog i feel like the dog represents like a lion as well i'm not sure why i think it's because it's got like a fluffy mane but yeah so water signs and leo and let's see what else we've got. You'll find what you seek. That is perfect. This this just sums it up, doesn't it, really? If you've ever suddenly found and been loved by someone amazing, awesome, fun and fantastic, chances are astronomical you will again. If you haven't yet found such a person, chances are astronomical you will. It's up to you, the universe. So as I say, this is someone who's very wholesome and they could also like space they could also like looking at the stars and astronomy and that sort of thing. You could also get the signs that you see signs like heart shaped things and love and that sort of thing that will come very prominently. You decide that you definitely want to love and it might just suddenly hit you and you think, oh my God, I really want a relationship now. Um, I've worked on myself. This is this is a time that I really want to settle down. So when you could meet this person, ace of swords. So you could actually already be with this person. You could meet this person when you're outside. I'm getting 15 days, 10 weeks, but I also think you might already know this person. You could also meet them when you're traveling or you could meet them online because I'm seeing like different countries. You can meet them on a plane as well, which is really strange, but that's what I'm getting. And the sound of music vibes. So hills and countryside. So they might live in the countryside or they could also love like the outdoors, that sort of thing. So yeah, you can meet this person pretty soon. As I say, you could already know them. Or it could be somebody you meet when you're travelling, blah, blah, blah. The end. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. I think I think the spirits wanted me to wrap up this reading. So yeah, thank you so, so much for watching. If you'd like to, please subscribe. We're also nearly at 500 subscribers, which is absolutely insane. I love every single one of you. Thank you so much for supporting me. Honestly, it means the absolute world. And I'm not just saying that. I love all your comments. So please comment down below if this resonated with you. And if you'd like to have a private reading with me, I'm doing a March sale at the moment where my five minute readings are only five pounds and you can have a general reading or you can ask me one question. Also, if you purchase this five minute reading and you enjoy what you see and it resonates, you can also buy a 25 minute reading for 25, 20, sorry, 20% 20 off when you buy a five minute reading. So yeah, so you'll get the 25 minute reading for 26 pounds, 40 instead of 33. So thank you so, so much for watching and don't forget to comment down below, subscribe, all that jazz, and I'll see you very, very soon. Bye. Group number four. Hello, group number four. Thank you for being here. And let's get started with your reading. So who is this person? We have the frog spirit, clear out the clutter. Number 28. And we also have the crow spirit, co-create with spirit. That's nice. I really like that. So first of all, I'm getting a grounded earth sign. 
someone who likes the outdoors and we also getting an air sign someone who loves to be free someone who doesn't like to be tied down but they will be tied down in a relationship but not in a negative way you'll it, it will be a very good um balance between having your own space and letting yourself be free and kind of explore but also being together which is really really nice and i'm also what else am i feeling i'm feeling like you've been feeling quite small and um uncomfortable I feel like you've had to change up your life quite a bit in the last few months. You've had to maybe change your diet, change different environments around you. And this is what's um, bringing in this new relationship because you're focusing on yourself. Sorry, I just smudged my mascara. <laughs> Rub my eyes, smudged my mascara. That is not good. So this could be somebody who is very stable, knows what they want. I feel like they're very financially stable as well. We also have... The coyote spirit, trust in divine detours. So I feel like you could have had a, quite a few previous relationships that haven't really worked out. And this person is going to be the person that works out. And it's all of this has led up to this person. And they are very suited for you. It's someone you have waited a long time for. Or you feel like you've waited a long time for this person. And they're definitely coming in very soon. So we have the magic of nature. Kindness creative expression and sexuality so first of all let me just say this could be earth air or fire sign water sign no, okay this is all the signs this is all the signs definitely they could also have earthy quality very grounded and i feel like the the sex is going to be really good between you two very passionate and it's also going to be you're going to open yourself up more and i feel like you haven't had many good experiences to do with intimacy and this is a sort of relationship that's going to really bring out that intimacy and I feel like I'm touching my ear quite a bit I don't know what that is I'm getting that spirit is listening in I feel like you've been getting signs through your ears about who this person is you could have an earache you could be listening to certain music and you'd be like oh my god this resonates to exactly how I feel the music could also be bringing up emotions in you that could be drawing you to this person which is really really good open yourself up that's good good sign and it's also a sign of you being uh, kind to yourself this person is also very kind and is very creative you two I feel like are very creative in different ways but also you have a similar a similar passion for creativity I feel like you may have, may have a hobby that in like together may have a hobby that's very similar and you also like nature, you like nature walks, maybe like running in the nature, you like running in the nature, running in nature, you like um, the woods, you like maybe the water as well, beaches, that sort of thing. Let's see what else we got. We got temperance, we got the ten of swords. So whoever this person is, let's have a look. I feel like... All the time that you're neglecting yourself, this person is going to have trouble coming in. It's all about filling up your own cup and being the person that you are wholeheartedly and not and being completely authentic with yourself. So there's going to be a lot of balance and a lot of patience is going to have to be given to this relationship. I feel like, as I say, where, if this person is an earth sign, I feel like earth signs do move quite slowly. But this is a good sign because it's, it's opening you, you two up very naturally. So there's no forcing. And I feel like you need to not force anything in this relationship because that's when it might start crumbling. And it's just letting letting the natural flow of it come through. What have we got? Ten of Swords. Well, the Ten of Swords, it means painful endings, deep wounds, betrayal, loss and crisis. So what I'm thinking is, is you've had some deep wounds you've really been working on. And the more you give yourself time to heal and any emotions that come up is going to bring you to this person because all this all this emotion that's coming up recently I feel very recently within the last three weeks has been coming up it's all leading to this relationship and yeah so just take it take your time as I say this person is very balanced and you're very balanced so once you two to get together you both will be very balanced with each other so temper is number 14 and four and one make five so i feel like you could meet this person in five days five weeks five months you may already know this person as well because i feel like they could be in your sphere they could work with you they could be in your school i can feel like they're behind you i feel like they're behind you looking at you observing maybe they're your boss maybe i'm not too sure and we also have yeeha so i feel like the pace is being picked up now there's the pace is being picked up and it's just 
it's just keep creating this balance with yourself make sure that you're looking after yourself and this person will come in really nicely so we've got when it comes to choosing who will be in your life i recommend you value in their yeeha quality above all others have it your way special orders don't upset us the universe so this is going to be someone who's going to be really special and worth waiting for someone you've never really dated before they're going to have this like essence that you're like wow i need some of that give me some of that i've been missing that and I need it. And it's not going to be a desperate energy though. It's a very kind of like whole completion energy. Let's see what else we've got. Physical appearance. Brown hair. Blue eyes. Ginger hair, blue eyes. Yeah, dark brown hair. I'm not seeing any blonde in this reading. Anything else? That number four needs to know. Group four needs to know. I'm getting a number 16 as well. So this person, I don't know, maybe 16 is their favourite number or you keep seeing 666 or 111, that sort of thing. And we also have the otter spirit. You are never alone. Oh my God. Isn't that just so cute? <laughs> I love this. It's so cute. As I said in um, another group, I have just recently got this deck and I haven't seen all these cards yet. And I've never seen this card. This is so cute. Also, as I said, that the number six and four and two make six. So definitely number six is going to be very prominent when you meet this person. And yeah, let's see what You Are Never Alone says. Like true friends, otters nurture each other and express their affection through touch. Actions such as holding hands and giving hugs offer reassurance that we are never really alone and that we are always cherished. Okay, so what I'm getting is this is connected to the sexuality card. This is a, a relationship that you're not scared to be, to touch each other and there's no manipulation when it comes to like sex or intimacy or any sort of hand holding, touching, that sort of thing. It's all very natural, you both want the same thing and it's all like you love hugging and kissing and that sort of thing. Um, it's all very natural, it's something that you both, you have that in common, your common ground is touch which is really really lovely. It says, have you ever been channeling all your affection to just one person or counting on only one friend or, or an individual to hold you up? Heedless of your resources all around you. You deserve support and love from many people. And when Otter Spirit arrives, you are reminded that you have a community. Somewhere is another friend who wants to experience the joy of giving to you and seeing your happiness as you receive their gift of affection attention and kindness otter spirits wants you to open your eyes to see that love is available to you from all directions do you believe it do you feel it so that is what i'm definitely getting someone is going to come in and is going to really change up your beliefs that like not everyone is the same and love is there and oh it's just it's so nice i love this this is so whole so when will you meet this person we have the seven of cups so this person you could meet in a week. You could already know this person as well. I feel like there could be a lot of options coming in as well. So when you have lots of options, this could be a sign that you can, one of these options could be your person. Yeah, seven weeks. I feel like you could know this person from online. You could also meet this person traveling. And yeah, seven weeks, seven days, that kind of ish. So yeah, thank you so, so much for watching and for tuning in. If this resonated, please comment down below. I love reading your comments. And we're nearly at 500 subscribers, which honestly means the entire world to me. I love reading your comments. Thank you so, so much. If you'd like to subscribe, the button is down below. Please feel free to subscribe. If you'd like a personal reading from me, I'm doing a March sale at the moment where my five minute, my five minute readings are five pounds and at the end of the month they'll go up to 11 pounds so get in there quick also if you purchase a five minute reading and you would like a longer reading you will get 20 percent off when you get a five minute reading so that will give you 20 percent off the 25 minute readings that will go down to 26 pounds 40 instead of 33 pounds so thank you so much for watching and for being here and i love you so much and i will see you all very soon bye